I'm Timmy from Mini Bowl Design, and this evening, for my second video, I just wanted to make a quick video. Somebody left a comment and said that Mountain House had a ton of fiber in it. So, uh, you know, that kind of surprised me because it sure doesn't feel it after you eat it for two or three days. So I, I dug out, I had uh, a bunch of different ones here, and I looked at the fiber content. Now, I'll just take, start reading them off here. You have to realize <coughs> it takes between 30 and 40 grams of fiber a day uh, for the average human being. Most people don't get that much, but, you know, they probably get half of that. Okay, let's start over here. This one is uh, macaroni and cheese, and it has uh, just one gram of fiber. That doesn't sound like a ton. I think a ton's a lot more than that. Uh, this one is beef stroganoff with noodles, and it has one gram of fiber. Uh, this one is also beef stroganoff. Uh, now, we got some here that do have some fiber. This one is chili mac with beef, and it has three. So if you ate three of these a day, you'd get nine grams of fiber. And you probably wouldn't eat three. You'd probably eat one. And this is, uh, yeah, so, you know one gram of fiber. This one has two grams of fiber. <laughs> uh, this one has one gram of fiber. So, uh, this one has one gram of fiber. Uh, it actually contains two and a half servings, so it would be two and a half grams of fiber. Uh, you know, and, and this one that has two grams of fiber would actually be five grams of fiber. It's not a ton. Uh, and, and all these that have one gram of fiber in them, which is by, by far most of them, would be actually two and a half grams of fiber if you ate the whole thing. I wouldn't eat the whole thing if I did. Two and a half grams of fiber, uh, and you're eating one of these a day, and then the rest of the time you're eating different stuff, that's not a ton of fiber. And that could be the reason why uh, they're not real friendly to the digestive tract. Okay, enough of that. Mountain House, I think we've pointed out, uh, one gram of fiber is not not high in fiber. Not unless you eat seven or eight of them a day. Okay, this is uh, refried beans. This little envelope has 10 grams of fiber. Of course, this is hamburger, and it doesn't have any fiber in it, hopefully. So uh, for you guys that have never seen dehydrated hamburger, let me move the camera in and... Uh, get a close-up of it for you so you can see what it looks like. It's about the consistency of uh, grape nuts. <laughs> Call it hamburger gravel. About the consistency of grape nuts. Let me take some pictures of it and you can look at those and I'll also photograph the uh, nutritional label on the uh also think that Mountain House, uh, even properly hydrated, uh, when you eat it, I think it tends to dehydrate you. Don't know that for sure, but uh, it feels that way. It feels like it uh, tends to dehydrate you, almost like it was a diuretic. I know you certainly wouldn't want to go, uh, you know, for a week and, and just eat Mountain House for every meal for a week. I think it'd probably kill you. <laughs> and if it didn't, you just wish you were dead. Second off, I don't think you can keep the stuff down if you if you ate this every day. It's pretty nasty. So, uh, for my next trick, I'm going to make uh, beef and bean burritos. I have uh, uh, dehydrated uh, refried beans with all the spices in with them already. Uh, cumin and, and all that other stuff. And I have uh, uh, dehydrated hamburger. Now, if I could find any fault with the hamburgers, it takes quite a while to rehydrate it. So what I do is uh, take some boiling water, about all the boiling water I'd need to make the entire meal here, and bring it to a boil and put the hamburger gravel in it first, and just set it off to the side, and, you know, while you're doing it something else, and let it set for 20 minutes and just rehydrate. Then I'd warm it back up and put my uh, refried bean powder in and stir it in and uh, make up my filling for my uh, 
burrito wrappers. I'm Timmy from Mini Bowl Design. Get out and hike, take a friend, enjoy the great outdoors, and more important than anything, try to have some fun today, and try to have a really great day. Bye-bye.